it was wild. I mean, I thought my last labor was wild. This was wild on another level. The swelling in my eyes is what's like the most painful. I looked in the mirror and was just like, who is this person? Yesterday, the kids met the baby for the first time. Oh. Should we say his name on three? One, two, three. Oh my gosh, I should give you guys a warning. If, if like black eyes gross you out, don't look now because I'm gonna keep showing you a close up. <laughs> about what I want to film after I put the birth vlog up or even if I want to film um, what that looks like I've been praying about it just because I've been on this journey of showing my kids less and less and less and so obviously now that I have one more kid it's it's a lot to think about and um, you know decide like what I want to show and what I want to share and my brain will probably be all over the place because I just had a baby and I'm still recovering and a little disoriented from all of it. I don't know if you could even tell from my face looking completely beat up still. Um, <laughs> but that was the most difficult, challenging labor that I've had yet. And I've never felt like this in my recovery period, like the days right after giving birth. Today is actually our first full day back home and it is my third day after giving birth. So I definitely feel better than I did <laughs> yesterday, actually a lot better. Um, yesterday when we were still at the hospital, like it was a struggle getting up, getting out of bed, you know, walking, going to the bathroom alone. Well, I just gave birth to my third baby about 24 hours ago and I'm about to try to put a little bit of makeup on so we can take a couple photos <sighs> but I thought I would get some footage of what my face looks like my eye is completely bloodshot very swollen all around both my eyes my eyes hurt really bad actually that's the swelling in my eyes is what's like the most painful I have broken capillaries all over my face, literally everywhere. I've never even, I didn't even know that this can happen. I don't know, I thought it was kind of interesting. I looked in the mirror and was just like, who is this person? <laughs> this is crazy. Um, but at the same time, I feel like a bit of a warrior. So we'll see how these photos turn out. <laughs> we'll see what we can do, but just astonishing and what mamas can do and what we go through to do it. The baby on the other hand looks amazing. <laughs> anyway, I am slowly recovering, but this situation with my face is very new to me. Um, it's kind of funny because looking back at like the pictures I have immediately after giving birth to Jace, it was so different. I mean, I had taken an epidural for that labor. I had like my makeup, my hair, everything looked so good. Even with Aria, even though it was unmedicated. This is very new for me to feel and look this beat up after birth. I think it's a little bit hard because it's like, it's in my face. And so I, maybe that's why I've also been debating like, do I want to film and do I want to share this? Part of me is like, yeah, girl, like, you're a warrior. You look like you just got out of a boxing ring. <laughs> and then the other part of me is like, I wouldn't actually go out in public like this. I have a black eye at this point. So it'll probably be, I don't, I don't know, a couple days, a week before this settles. <laughs> I've never had this before. Let me know in the comments if this is something that you dealt with. I didn't even know that this was a thing. Obviously, it's from pushing so hard. Pushing was like the absolute hardest part of this labor and it was wild. I mean, I thought my last labor was wild. This was wild on another level. 
I didn't expect it to be this way or go this way. I wasn't prepared for it. Um, let me know if you guys want to see another video that's actually sharing like the full story because I think by now I have my labor vlog up. I'm not really sharing exactly what's going on. So I could share another video where I'm giving you more of a play-by-play -play of like what is happening and explain a lot more, maybe do like a Q and A and answer questions too. Yeah, today's been our our first full day back home. Yesterday, the kids met the baby for the first time. Still haven't given his name. I'm actually waiting for Richie to come up so we can kind of share that together. We're not gonna share his full name. We're just gonna share his little nickname. That's what we feel comfortable with doing this time. The kids um, kind of went as I thought it would. Jace is a little bit like, he always acts a little bit off when we like first see him after a while or like a big event or something happens. So after like 30 minutes, he was just like obsessed. He's obsessed with the baby. He asks about him all the time, wants to check on him all the time, and it is the sweetest thing in the world. He is just like big brother mode. Aria, a little bit cautious, not quite sure what's going on, and just kind of taking it in, and I see her eyeing him. She has her little moments where she wants to give him pat pats and hold him, and that like little nurturing side of her kicks in, which has been really cute too. It's been a really special time. Um, also a bit of a whirlwind, but we're just happy to be home. Um, last night with him, you know, went how it, go, how it goes with newborns. We're feeding every like two to three hours. He seems to be sleeping longer stretches during the day, of course, in new classic newborn fashion than at nighttime. Nighttime is when like he's pooping a bunch and I have, you know, I keep getting up to change him. He's just like a little more fussy and so I've been giving him the pacifier a bit. Oh, that feels good. That feels really good to stretch. Richie's joining us. He's been a rock star all morning. Took the kids away for a long time. The boy's still sleeping how? I told them that he's been sleeping so much better like during the day than at night. You Your know? milk isn't? Yeah, my milk's, my milk, well, pretty much. What do you mean pretty much? It's in or it's not? Yeah, it's in. My milk's in. Oh, boy. Should we say his name on three? One, two. You're not in the frame. One, two, three. Theo. Theo. T H E O. Theo. And that means God's gift. God's gift. And he was a big boy. He was eight pounds, nine ounces. Yeah, we think he looks a lot like Jace. You're such an angel. Like, you know what? He's, um, he's a lot more like calm and content and he's not like as aware do you remember other babies like they would be eyes open looking around more curious like he doesn't really do that <laughs> oh yeah my mom's coming over tomorrow yeah i'm so grateful we've been having a lot of help like my mom's already been here with the kids while we were gone richie's mom will come help richie's been amazing yeah i'll let you guys know how i'm feeling and i'm I try to recover from getting beat up by this little guy. <laughs> I'll show him the black eye. It's like one of the first things Jay said to me when I came home. He's like, Mommy, what's wrong with your eye? I didn't even know how to explain to him. I push, I had to push really hard. <laughs> to be honest, I look worse than I did. I'm less swollen, but the eye looks worse because now the black eye is like coming in. He's doing the thing where he makes all the faces. What you doing? What you doing? <laughs> 